Oh, you're not going to say anything to me? Oh, oh well, that was a mistake. Uh, um, excuse me. You can't go through here. So, um... So, sorry. Oh, it's no problem. I, I don't mind. I just thought you wouldn't talk to me at first, but actually just go in this path. So, well, I'm not gonna bother with your job, so I can check out this door over here. Okay, a broken piano. A piano keyboard. One of the keys is missing. Well, let's try to find it. Or them. Or they. I, I don't know. Can I somehow... Nope, there's nothing in this room here. What about... No? You're not sure which key the missing one is. It doesn't go by A, B, C, D, E, F, G. But where does it start from? I should know this. No, no, no. Wait, you think it starts from QWE? No, that can't be right. You may be getting a little mixed up. The missing key seems to be an A. Where could that key be? Because it certainly isn't on this keyboard. Wait, what? She has no ideas. Something just play that piano. Was it you? Yeah, I, I think so. Oh, C, D, E, F, G. Mm, well. Oh! It's not a piano key, but a key key. The kind that opens doors. You suppose that is more useful? Well, yeah, it actually is, so... Thank you, keyboard piano. It's probably for this door, right? You unlock the... Hold on. Where did this piano key come from? You found the right key this time. You unlock the door. Great. It's you. What are you trying to prove? I told you. We'll never make it out. We may as well be dead. Perhaps you're trying to be friendly. Well, I can say I wouldn't want a friend. But this isn't the time. And you're not the person. Sorry. Now then. Later. Well, she's not exactly the friendly type. I see. Change you. A girl, set in a far off corner, all on her own, as she always had. On this day, a boy approached her and asked, Hey, what's your name? Slightly startled, she answered in almost a whisper, tripping over so few words. The boy laughed. You're such a shy little thing, but I'll have you talking someday, I swear it. Though, the girl lacked the courage to reply. This upset her inside. He'll make her talk, will he? She had heard it from others before, and she knew what it meant. They wanted to change her. But, did she want to be changed? If she were to change, she would do it herself, the way she wanted. That so many saw her and believed that they had the right, the duty, to change her to their whims. She worried for what it meant. And until she changed, she would forever be told the same thing. I'll change you, no matter what it takes. Wait, there's blood on this book now. Well, 
I'm fine. This place looks pretty peaceful, so I'm, I'm okay with blood right now. So, let's give this back to you. But... I don't have the key... What? I thought I found the key for the keyboard in the door here. Ah, whatever. Oh, no! Hey, Mr. Burke. Okay, no! Oh, well, no, how? Oh, gosh, damn it. I need to be a little bit more careful about this place because I, yeah, I must not jump over the edge here. How was this? You found a leaf. Well, that's useful, I guess. Journey, Chapter 2 Walking the roads, she asked, if anyone knew of such a place as she sought. But it seemed that no one did. Others before had asked the same. They told her. She asked where those who had asked went. They say they didn't know. No answers. A few would even hear out her questions to begin with. So, she continued to walk. Oh! Thank you, book. That's useful for my progress. What are those? TLMM. She longed to walk on the land rather than swim in the sea. So, she made a deal with a witch for a potion which gave her human legs. But the human saw her as an abomination, and the potion soon wore off. She died alone, floundering on the beach. Wait, is this a story of the little mermaid? It sounds like it. Another one of this safe here. Can I somehow open it up? I like safe. It requires a four digit combination. I just picked four random numbers for the code, but even if I forget it, that's okay. I'll always be able to check the notes for my piano. Oh, piano! Okay, I can go back there. Rest in peace, ma'am. Now, where is it? No notes on the piano. Hmm. Maybe you should try playing it with your keyboard again. Maybe? Oh, I think I got something here. A note appeared on the stand, but it only shows a quarter of the four-digit code. Oh, wait, zero. Zero is not gonna help me at all. C, D, E, F, G. Uh, well... Yeah. Nope. It's just a zero. That's not gonna help me at all. Well, zero is all I got right now. And I guess it's... I guess it's better than nothing, but... Mm, okay. I just have to find more numbers somewhere. Let's see. Is there anything else around here? Except for those monsters? Oh, I can probably go up here. That's cool. Uh, there's a book over here, but there's fire there. Crap. Okay, what's this? Oh, Mr. Book. Hey, well, interesting play. Hey, whoa, I almost hit it. Oh, another leaf. Excuse me, monsters. I'm taking this. Yay. Okay, I got two leaves now. Can I please? No, this is too difficult to pass through. Let's go up here again. Let's see now. There we go. Okay, what's in here? There's an arrow here. A hairdryer. There's a power cord, but it has to plug on the end. Will you use an item? No? A bathtub. What do you want to do? Let's... Let's pull out the... Plug? You pull hard, but the plug won't come out. Why would it be stuck like this? 
Oh, what's this? A tub can only be drained if there is something to drain. Is that not common sense? Oh, I thought there was water in it, but apparently it's empty. Well, let's fill it up. You twist the facet, but nothing happens. Most likely there's no water running. Okay. Well, well, for all intents and purposes, it's you. There's nothing here to use, so... Screw this. Now, can I enter this room here? It's pitch dark in here. You need the light to get anywhere. What about... It's locked. The door is being kept firmly shut. I seek to travel far and wide. I no doubt to risk a task. But with my name, I might imply there's things I want to ask. What? The next page just has a Q on it. Is it question? Oh! No? Wait, I seek to travel far and wide and no doubt risky task. Wait, quest! It's quest, right? Yeah, it's quest. If the word is not quest, then I have no idea anymore. Let's go. There we go. I don't trust this room. I want to talk to Mr. Brook first. Now, we can finally explore the room. Let's see. Actor. I sat and thought it over all while seasons passed me by. My show did end, but at much length, I could no longer lie. Oh, okay. It looks like a book, but it lacks any pages. There's only a cover here. No, why would I use an item on it? Back in the days, where it was still of help to wish for a thing, there was a beautiful and bountiful tree. It was known as the Tree of Knowledge, for it knew all things and gladly imparted its wisdom to people. With time, however, the tree shed its leaves and began to wither away. The people worried, but the tree quelled their fears. I may die, but my leaves will remain. Use them to convey your own wisdoms. And more than that, your own hopes. The people took his words to heart and began to record stories such as these for all manner of purposes. Then, three apples fell from the sky, one for the author, one for the storyteller, and one for the listener. Oh! Wait, who am I supposed to be? An apple? You don't really want it. You don't know where it's been. Okay, I'm, I'm fine. You. Just a single green book. Why did I take it? The book has a strange symbol on it. But you're sure you've seen it before. Have I? The wish of the Alpha allows the will of the Omega. But their thoughts must be as one. Hmm, interesting. Let's see, there's nothing more to read there except for this shelf over here. C and D R. She was always teased and tormented by wicked stepsisters. One night, when her stepsisters left for the castle ball, she wished to go there herself. Miraculously, her wish was heard, and she was given beautiful clothes to wear. But when midnight struck, the magic illusion was gone, and she was promptly thrown out. Her life was only more miserable from then on. Why are these stories so horrible and sad compared to like the Disney movies of them? Like this was about Cinderella, and 
Yeah. It ended up very badly. Wait, what? There's nothing here. Well, I... I guess there's nothing to do in here. I mean, out here. Yeah. Let's leave. We're done here. I've read you right. I think I have. I believe that I've read you. My memory is really bad right now. Hey, book. Alright, so... I still need to find the code for that safe. Somehow. I don't have a... No, I don't have a lantern. Or a flashlight or anything. I really, really need a light to enter this room here. But where am I supposed to get it? So, let's see. There we go. It shows the whole foot. Ah! 0418. Thank you. It was actually easy as that. I just didn't realize it. Because I'm not that smart. But thank you. I'm glad there's a walkthrough on the internet. I'm glad the internet exists. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to do this. Okay, so... Finally! 0418. It opened. There looks to be a flashlight inside. The flashlight seems to be out of batteries. No, wait. There it goes. It appears to be solar powered. Oh, that's cool. Now, is there anything else in here? Oh, it's empty. Okay. Let's see. I need to get up here. Excuse me. Wait, I'm not gonna go here. There are way too many of them. Screw these. But I'm glad you're not dangerous, you're actually friendly. In a way. You can push me over the edge, but you are kind of friendly. Just kind of. Hey, Mr. Book. So, let's go. Oh my gosh, it's dark in here. Alright. I don't feel safe. At all. How does this flashlight work? A solar-powered flashlight. It needs to be charged outside to use inside. Ah, so if I walk around here for a little while, like, let's take a round around this hall here. And hopefully, the flashlight will be charged enough for me to explore the whole room without it turning off. Because if it turns off, I'm screwed. And I don't want that to happen. So, it's just bathrooms over here. Oh dear, no, 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 that was scary as heck, man. That was scary as heck. Is there a way for me to like, you know, know how much power it is in it? Because this is scaring me, I don't like the darkness. Okay, I need to walk around here for a little while. Let's explore some other places here. There's no point in being in here. What am I doing? I had no idea. I'm just waiting for my flashlight to charge up, you know? La la la. Charging up my flashlight. Let's go, man. Okay. Let's go again. I have to do this. No, I just... I'm going to count the steps. That's what I'm going to do. If I get stuck in there, I'm dead. So, let's go. Oh, did, wait, I, I messed it up. There. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't know, man. I don't know.